Hey guys, this is Project Dave, playing some Exo Primal. This is Galway Alpha. Um, the, it's like a thunderstorm. It's kind of like if you're a Diablo 2 sorceress. That's a way to think about it. You're casting lightning bolts that come down from the sky and you can charge it. And some of the upgrades are like you can charge it to full and it will do double damage but use your full magazine. Which in this case is probably probably more worth it than your typical use the full magazine ability. Uh, I'm not sure what the other one is, but I'm sure I'll look at it later. As far as whether this mech is pay to win, I don't. I think it, this one and Zephyr, they're pretty much completely different play styles than the way you would play the mech normally. So it's better to think of it as a unique mech instead of just is this worth playing instead of the original mech? Um, I think for most of the mechs, that's, there's like a direct easy comparison, but for this one, you don't have a heal, so you're no longer a healer, basically. I mean, you do have a heal, but it's just the sound wave. But I don't think the sound wave is going to be sufficient to, to heal your party. Just throwing that one out there. In at least not in like MQs, which seems like every Q is like MQ now, so which is good. All right. Still haven't had a bad Q so far. Um, what else? Oh, so if we just consider it as its own mech, how good is this mech relative to like the average mech? Obviously, it's nowhere near as good as Vanilla Barrage. I haven't played New Barrage yet. I'm guessing New Barrage is also good. But, well, I'm going to play the last three tonight and then do the Savage Gauntlet if I stay awake for long enough. Savage Gauntlet, I think, is at 11, but it might be midnight. So six hours from now from when I'm recording this and probably like four and a half hours from when this goes up. Um, sorry. <laughs> Just... Trying to focus on what's actually happening. I'm not sure what the other blue one is. I guess I should look for that. Pay more attention. <laughs> My apologies. It's been 16 hours and lots of uh, tactical RPGs. Or not tactical RPGs. The RPGs. Gameplay since I played this. So. Trying to focus. Um, I think the mech is probably like somewhere around 7th best or whatever, if played really well. But you are going to need a dedicated dealer probably if you're using this mech. So it's, it's pretty much pure CC. Skywave is mostly CC to begin with, but CC that can heal. And now this version is pure CC but can also do damage. So if that's something that's appealing to you, it seems like a difficult playstyle, but that doesn't mean it's bad. It could be very good, especially in probably PvP scenarios, which is fairly common trends. A lot of the, the mechs seem like they might be quite good in PvP, but hard to test out exactly, especially not without leveling up the mechs to 10. It's, oh, these these extra emojis are part of the, the pack that Capcom gave me, so I've, been, I've seen a a couple of them before, but I didn't know where they came from. Those ones you can't get out of uh, packs, so I don't think you have to buy the bundle of wings. But thanks for watching the video, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Sorry I wandered off of it, but I did eventually return to a focused I'll discussion back. a little bit. I'll see you next time. Let us begin. I will transfer you to the combat zone. Have a super day. You have my thanks. Interdimensional transfer complete. The war game will begin shortly. Have a super day.
initiating area defense mission. Preparing combat area. You must defend the specified area. Go to the area near the marker and begin defending it. Summoning Sniper Leo Swords. Summoning Sinonithosaurus. Summoning Dilophosaurus. Area defense progress, 25%. Summoning gas needles. Area defense progress, 50%. Summoning Raptors. Summoning Gas Neosaurus. Summoning Dilophosaurus. Area Defense Progress, 75%. Objectives faster than the enemy team. Fantastic. Follow the watcher. Proceed to next mission. Initiating area defense mission. Preparing combat area. You must defend the specified area. Go to the area near the marker and begin defending it. Summoning Dilophosaurus. Summoning Stegosaurus. Area defense problems, 25%. Summoning Raptors. Defense progress, 50%. Summoning Rattles. Summoning Gas Neosaurus. Area defense progress, 75%. faster than the enemy team. Initiating Dinosaur Call Mission. Preparing combat area. Summoning a T-Rex. is on the move. Pursue it. Summoning Sniper Neosaurus. Summoning a Stegosaurus. Summoning Sniper Neosaurus. 
the final mission. Brace yourselves for interdimensional travel. Prepare for combat. The enemy to the final mission. Act quickly to close the performance gap. The first team to complete all of the assigned objectives wins. Do your part and generate robust combat data. I have awarded the enemy team a dominant attack. They may invade the hostile dinosaur. Summoning Pachycephalosaurus. Summoning Pachycephalosaurus. Summoning Pachycephalosaurus. Summoning Umbral Neosaurus. Summoning Gas Neosaurus. Dinosaurs are attacking the VTOL. Pay attention to its durability. Summoning Pachycephalosaurus. Dominator has been generated for your team. 
Use it to commandeer a dinosaur and attack the enemies. A dimensional crossing activated. You may invade the enemy team's combat area. Disrupt the enemy's mission progress. VTOL durability 50%. VTOL durability 25%. Destruction imminent. Resetting the mission. Please try again. Proceed to next mission. Summoning the Carnotaurus. Summoning Pachycephalosaurus. Best exo fighters in this war game. 